Good afternoon, people. Watch Women 65. Lisa Boyce here. Um, I'm going to give you the gospel again. It's in 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4, that Christ died for our sins, past, present, future, was buried, and rose again on the third day for our sins. We are saved by grace through faith in Christ alone, not of ourselves, not of works. At least any man should boast. God gave us grace. It is grace that we are saved. He gave his only begotten son that whosoever believe in him shall not perish but have eternal life. The key word is believe. Once we accept Christ, we will never lose our salvation. You are saved and sealed until the day of redemption and your rapture ready. Uh, I got to give you this article. This is why I'm here this early. Usually I don't come on this early unless something is going on. But uh, this is off of the U.S. Sun. It says that uh, nuclear war, China ramps up. Nuclear stockpile with terrifying hypersonic and ballistic missiles in battle for nuclear power with the U.S. Now, the thing that I can see happening, something happening before this... Uh, inauguration. I could see something like this happening. This would trigger the rapture. I, from I mean, I'm just being honest. That's what I'm seeing. That's what I could see happening. Um, it says China's ramping up its nuclear stockpile, including with terrifying hypersonic missile. A new report has found. Um, it says the, the bulletin of the atomic science. Uh, Scientist study says China has 350 nuclear warheads, scientifically more than previous thought, as it battles for nuclear power with the U.S. Uh, it goes on to say, and this has a lot of pictures here, goes on to say that estimates from the U.S. Department of Defense have put the figure in the low 200s. The ramping up of China's nuclear forces comes amid growing tension and military rivalry with the United States over the disputed South China Sea in Taiwan. Excuse me. A new report arrived at the number by counting both operational warheads and newer weapons still in development. These include hypersonic missiles, intercontinental, ballistic missiles, and submarine launch weapons. Among the weapons being deployed are the DF-26, which can reach a top speed of Mach 18, or 18 times faster than the speed of sound. It is capable of traveling 2,000 miles, far enough to blitz the U.S. territory of Guam in the Pacific Ocean. Uh, many of the weapons are deployed on enormous transporters, which gives them greater surveillability. Uh, in the event of any conflict, um, an H-6 bomber was recently seen carrying what is believed to be a mocked up of a hypersonic missile, which would give the country another means of deploying nuclear weapons. The report is written by Hans Christ, uh, Christensen, the director of the Nuclear Information Project at the Federation of the American Scientists and Matt Corda, a research associate at, FM, at FAS. China is continuing the nuclear weapons uh, modernization program that it initiated in the 1980s and increased in the 1990s and 2000s, fielding more types and greater number of nuclear weapons than ever before, they say. China has poured billions of pounds into modernizing its military as it continues to threaten to invade Taiwan, which it regards as part of its territory. Um, this is an interesting article. I'm going to link this in the description box. It says that China's president has ordered his troops to train harder and fight to the death as he called on the military to be ready for war. President Xi said his country 
country's two million strong armed forces should train under real combat conditions and not fear hardship, according to Beijing state-run media. In October, the PLA staged a terrifying war game with simulated invading the island. The country has also stealthily taken over swatches of uh, South China Sea by building military bases on artificial islands. Meanwhile, it has emerged China has developed a new stealth bomber, which is feared to be capable of launching a sneak nuclear strike on the U.S. Navy base in Pearl Harbor. This is serious. Um, I see us leaving out of here sooner than what people think. Um, you know, and I, I'm not setting a date or anything like this, and this is nothing to fear because the church knows what's going to happen. But this is definitely biblical. And what brings this to mind for me is Zechariah 12.3. So, you know, I'm just putting this out there to let you know what's going on. Uh, I'm going to link this article in the description box, folks. It's time to get saved. It's time to look up and wait and know that we're about to get out of here. Anytime now. So I will be back later if anything else comes up. Thank you.